welcome to the crew. Hi guys, so today we're gonna be filming a empty house tour. We've been building this house for a year. We are so excited to show you guys the structure of the home. There is still a lot of projects that are getting done in this house that we're hiring a private contractor to do, which we'll explain more in the video. Before we get into this video, the house is four bedroom, four bath, three car garage. The backyard is not finished. The backyard is actually getting ripped up. So I'm excited for you guys to see this house and I think we should just get into it. So we're filming this on Thanksgiving. First room, when you walk in, this is going to be the dining area. So this right here is gonna be a So this right here is gonna be a chandelier that we're gonna hang up here. So this room could be an office room or it could be a dining room and we chose to do it as a dining room. And then right over here, this is what's actually under our stairs. The sliver of the house that Kayla gave me for my own comfort was like where I want to be relaxing and playing my games and it's basically like a small. You gotta show them bit more of this. Oh, and and right over here is is a nice little area that you can't really use, um, but thank you, Kayla. I'll take it. He's obviously playing around right now. So this is our front door. So this is the dining room and then the front door. Then we have a chandelier hanging here, which will be replaced with the black one that we bought. You're gonna see a lot of boxes in here because we still have to change out all the builder grade chandeliers. And then we also still have to hang our mirrors. We also have a lot of projects going on right now in this house. So that's why we haven't moved in immediately. Behind you is the first bathroom and it's a half bath. Here's the bathroom. This is our new light fixture right here and it's gonna be replaced. So it's actually gonna be three lights instead of two. The area behind you is where most of our budget went when building this house. This is my favorite part of the home. It's the kitchen because the kitchen is huge. So first part of the kitchen, I don't know what you would call this. I love that this kitchen has so much storage. So right here we would put a round dining table and then we have this light fixture that we're gonna hang up right here. So we're switching this out. We're still debating on what we're gonna do with this area. This could either be like where we put all our wine, even though we don't drink wine. All our pretty plates would go right here. Lots of cabinets, lots of drawers. I love that. If you turn on this side, this is our front porch because our home is like a more modern farmhouse style. Elijah's taking over. So this is the island. It's a really large island as you can see. <laughs> One thing that Kayla did that was different is she did the white countertops with the black cabinets and then on this side she did the black countertops on the white cabinets. This is my all time favorite part of the kitchen. Uh, the apron sink, this is the one thing that I requested when we were designing this house is this because I'm the one that does the dishes. So, oh, yeah? I, I needed this. Oh I, yeah, I you do, do the dishes? dishes? I do okay. all the dishes. Yeah. <laughs> this is our dishwasher right here. This is just like another builder grade thing that we might replace. Uh, so this whole community is all natural gas. So right here, this is the double oven, um, which we won't be using much because we don't do a lot of baking. But it's nice to have two ovens. <laughs> And then our microwave is down over here as well, which Elijah doesn't like. He thinks it's such a problem to just bend down. Just to bend down to microwave your food. This is my favorite part of the kitchen is the backsplash with the wall shelf. It is so beautiful. Like this is how I pictured our kitchen to look like. And then we have our gas grill right here, which is such a dream. I can't wait to start cooking here. This is our pantry which we have nothing in here because our carpenter is gonna come and build shelves in here. So it would look really nice. All right, so over here, this is where uh, the coffee bar is going to be. A nice espresso machine so I can make Kayla coffee in the morning so she doesn't bite my head off. That's gonna be really <laughs> great. Uh, more cabinets just because, I guess. We actually have dishes in here. We've been washing dishes like slowly. These are all brand new. Um, some of them are from Lulu and Georgia and they actually sent us these so thank you to them And then this right here is supposed to be our fridge The island also has this really nice accent on there, which I love here is a better view of our kitchen So we're gonna change out these light fixtures as well. And this is actually the Light fixture we're gonna put so this is obviously the living room uh, As you can see there's a chandelier right here. It's a pretty large chandelier that we're gonna be placing for the fan uh, a nice upgrade. I really like this. 
This is how the chandelier looks like. Ugh. It looks like this, but it doesn't have this part right here. So it's huge when the kids stuff. come home from school, from school and they can put their little Backpack. like backpacks. Oh, there's four. We have to have two more kids, babe. Hell no. <laughs> All right. Um, this is the next part. This is the laundry room in this area. Um, Don't mind our toilet right yeah, here. Yeah, yeah. We're doing a lot of work in the bathroom, so this way it was ripped out. Anyways, this is a laundry room. I absolutely love the tile work in here. It's beautiful. Um, this is where the washer and dryer is going to go, guys. And then our carpenter is taking this out on Friday, and he's going to put a huge black stained wood shelf right here. We didn't want to pay the builders to do all that work, so we kind of just hired like private contractors to finish up the rest of the house. Okay, now this one, you guys are going to be like, what the heck? You guys close on a house that looks like this. You're going to see the, our bathroom. This is the master bathroom. We ripped up the whole entire bathroom because we did not like the tile selects that we made and the layout of it. And the funny thing is, is that me and Elijah changed out the bathroom tiles twice already. So this is basically our third time changing it out. Our laundry room does have a door connected to our master bath, and this is our master bathroom. <laughs> Are you guys ready? Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, we basically ripped up the flooring. This stayed on because he's going to level it out, um, but this was the tile work we did for the shower, and it, it's probably the worst thing ever. If you're thinking about doing a shower, don't do stone, rock, because the grout, like you guys can see, the grout gets so dirty. This we're keeping still. I have my little vanity right here. I can't wait to show you guys how the bathroom will look like completed. I feel like we made the right choice. Third time's a charm, but. This is how huge the toilet room is. Oh yeah. Is that what you call this, a toilet yeah, room? I guess so. Yeah, so you can take your shits. Mm -hmm. This right here is just extra storage in our bathroom. And then this is our master closet, which that's the door to the toilet. But this one is actually bigger than our closet in our old house. But we're having our carpenter come and build up a whole closet system in here. So that's why it's just looking like this. Our doors are hella tall. So it looks like we're short. So over here is our master bedroom and our master bedroom is downstairs. And we're gonna change that out to a black fan. Elijah actually put up all the blinds up a couple days ago in this house. So he did all of that. We already went in contract for the person who's gonna do our backyard, but I don't think that starts till the end of December. So the projects that we want done in the house, we want done before we move in. This is part of our backyard. I think the garage is closed. Oh, I'm not gonna open it. Ellie, oh. you wanna show them upstairs? Yeah, I can. Okay, show them upstairs. I love the stairs. We did a light staining to match our wood flooring, which I love. Banana, mommy. Banana. Banana. Perfect. So this up here, this is the loft. It's gonna be my second favorite part of the room, the house. Uh, this is where the L-shaped couch is gonna go. It's gonna go from here all the way to here. It's gonna be a nice big one. We're gonna have a nice TV right here. This is gonna be the play area for the girls. So a lot of her toys, a lot of the, a lot of stuff for the girls is where they're gonna be hanging out with me. Um, so I'm really excited about this area. It feels more cozy over here. Right here, this is the guest bedroom. Um, this is what it looks like. Here is the closet, a little, little nice size closet right there. Which our carpenter is gonna rip these wire shelving out and then build a whole built-in wardrobe, so this would be nice. Right here, this, this guest room comes with its own bathroom. Uh, this is what it looks like right now. Of course, we're gonna be taking these out and adding the new lighting. This is actually, uh, Kayla chose out these. Oh, that, so that's actually supposed to go to our bedroom, babe. Okay. Yeah, that's the wrong mirror. So the, it was a square mirror. That's why I was like, when did I buy this? This was for the bedroom. Okay. I well, totally forgot. All right, so the next room down the wall is this one. This is the other guest room. Could be Kayla's office if she takes it. I don't want an office. <laughs> Anyways, uh, this is a smaller guest room um, when we have people over for next Thanksgiving, maybe. This is the next closet, a little bit smaller, but the same thing. Again, we're gonna have the carpenter come in. He's gonna. He's gonna try and put four drawers in here, and then try to make as much space as he can. This is the third bathroom. It's gonna be shared between the guest room and our girls' room. Bye -bye. We kept it all simple because we went over our budget with the kitchen. <laughs> and then this is just 
I don't know what you would call this. This is just an extra storage closet. All the wired shelves you guys see in this home is all getting ripped up. Anyways, and this is the last room in the house upstairs. Uh, this is the girls' room right here. It's uh, a little bit larger than the other two rooms you just saw. So we're gonna have the girls have floor beds, one right here, one right there, I believe. Yeah. And then on this side, they'll have like their entertainment slash toys and whatever you would. I'm envisioning stuff. <laughs> and this is the only window upstairs that doesn't have a roof for them to climb down. Like her mother did. Anyways. Um, what? Okay guys, so that is pretty much it for our empty house tour. I hope you guys enjoyed. Can't wait for you guys to see how this house looks after everything's been done and finished up. It's gonna look really nice. The closet, I'm excited for the backyard. I'm excited for our new bathroom that we changed for the third time already. This is gonna be the start of our first journey for our house series. So let us know what type of videos you guys wanna see, like decorating the girls' bedroom, our bedroom, the living room. Thank you so much and we'll see you guys next time.